Good morning everyone, can you all see me? I don't know what is happening to my live streaming. I've been pressing the live button and it's been coming back saying I'm un a unable to stream. So before we get cracking, I just want to really make sure things are working well. So if you can see me on your screen and I'm talking and I'm nice and clear, please can you write in the chat, thumbs up, or give me a wave or something and I'm just going to grab my computer and make sure it's all working before we get going with our exercise regime. So let's have a look. Do, do, do. Super, can anybody see me at home? Is this working going through to you guys at the moment? Yes! Brilliant! Okay, thank you so much. I really apologise. I have no idea what is going on because I've done 50 odd videos during lockdown, didn't have a problem at all. And then the last three weeks, it seems to have gone haywire. So, <laughs> okay, let's get cracking. So what I'd like to do is um, get you set up for the exercise regime today. You will just need uh, two tins and make sure you're wearing comfortable clothes that you've rolled up any tricks, slips or hazards. You've got a drink of water to the side. This is a 30 minute exercise regime. So do stop at any time if you're feeling a bit tired or anything's hurting or you're, you're feeling something doesn't feel quite right. Do just stop and then join me back in for the action when you feel up to it again. Okay, so standing nice and tall, imagine that you've got a lovely golden thread lifting you up to the ceiling. Just drop your shoulders down. Let's start, 10 minutes on the clock for the warm up. Off we go. And we're gonna start with a nice, easy heel dig. So we're gonna dig the heel into the center. And you can hold on to your kitchen sideboard there if you need to, with a bit of balance. Helps out with the balance there. Good, if you feel happy, just let that heel dig into the floor. So we're just mobilizing through the ankle joints and the knee joints there. Good, keep that elongated spine really lifting up and then keep those shoulders nice and relaxed down. Fantastic. Good, now we're going to move into a little bit of a heel pump here, keeping your toes attached to the floor and just pumping out through the heels. Loosen off through those wrists. Good stuff there guys. Nice and easy. Brilliant. Now we're going to come out a little bit wider and we're going to go in for a knee bend and a little tap. So it's a little knee bend and tap. Good, again, holding onto the side there if you need to. Core in. Now with your tummy muscles, I'd like you to imagine that you're sucking your tummy in and up just a little bit. Good. And then back in for an easy walk. Easy walk. Now we're going to take in for a heel dig forward and two toe points coming out to the side. So it's a heel, toe, toe, and then centre other leg. Heel, toe, toe, centre, heel, toe, toe, centre, and again, heel, toe, toe, centre. Now we're just going to do small knee bends just here. Again, you've got your sideboard if you need to hold on to it. We're going to go for four knee bends and then a shoulder roll. Here we go. So we're going for four, three, two, one, and raise the shoulder up, round and back. Now let's take it down for two and one and raise the shoulders up, round and back. Alternating knee bend and shoulder raise. Knee bend and circle. Good. Knee bend and circle. Last one, knee bend and circle. Great, back in for our heel, toe, toe, together. And heel, toe, toe, together. Heel, toe, toe, together. Last one, toe, toe, four knee bends and four, three, two, one. This time take the shoulders up, round and forward. Good, for two, two, and one, up, round and forward, alternating, knee bend and forward, good, knee bend and forward, and knee bend and forward, good, one more, knee bend and forward, in for our heel, heel, toe, toe, together, and heel, toe, toe, together, and heel, toe, toe, last one, and heel, toe, toe, walk it out. 
that. Nice, easy walk. So, remember your levels though. Level one, keep it nice and low. Do hold on to the side. Level two, a little bit more effort. And level three, you're really starting to work out of your comfort zone. This is just the warm up. So do take it steady, you should be able to have a good conversation throughout. Nothing's feeling hard or challenging just yet. Brilliant, okay, nice wide stance. And this time I'm going to reach diagonally across the room, if you can hold on to the side there, and then you're going to keep that arm nice and straight, taking it to the other leg. So I'm reaching up my right arm, putting it down to my left leg. Now I'd like you to see if you can reach and then bend the knee. Good. Reach, push the bottom out and back as you're bending. Now I'm secretly getting you to do a bit of a squat here, so we're warming up through the legs, the calves, the bottom. Good. Lovely. We're going to go for one more. Reach and down. On to the other side. Here we go. And diagonally reach across. Good. Steady breath. That's it. Well done there, folks. Good, here we go, and two, and one, and reach. Nice wide arms, and stretch, and stretch. Now keeping your hips nice and steady, and straight and forward, and I'm pivoting through the top of my hips here. So I'm using my obliques and my abdominal muscles to reach and reach. Let's go for two more, two, and one. Good, walk it out, let's walk it out, super stuff. Now as we're walking, we're gonna walk it forward for four counts and then hold it for four. Here we go, one, two, three, four, and hold. Good stuff, and one, two, three, four, and hold, super. Take it forward, four, three, two, one. Now step, just one leg, back to me, three, four, and step. Good, and again, and four, three, two, one, and step, warming up now. Good, and back. Two, three, four, and step. Remember to hold on to the side if you need to. Four, three, two, one, and out. That's it, and four. Three, two, one, and out. Good, nice weight stance. Good, we're gonna go in for soft knees and a toe tap. Good, now we're gonna start to reach across the body and reach. So we're bringing the arms low and high, can you see? How I'm reaching down like a semicircle across the body. Good, rather than just going straight across. That's it. Lovely. Okay, march it out. Here we go. And march. Two, three, four, take it forward. Here we go. And march. Two, three, four, take it back. Same on this side. March. Two, three, four, take it forward. And march. Two, three, four, take it back. Ready with that leg now. March, two, three, four, take it forward. Here comes the leg. Two, and one, take it back. That's it, you got it. Two, and one, take it back. Forward, I should say. And two, and one, take it back. Good. Two, and one, take it forward. And two, and one, take it back. Last one now. Two, and one, and march, just here, good. Wide stance again, easy stance, and reaching right across, let's do our semicircle across the body, warming up through the obliques, down to the latimus dorsi on the back. That's it, well done. Let's go for four, three, two, and one, and march, good. Holding back onto your side board if you need to. Relax the shoulders nice and low. And let's work on the hips. We're going to stop the feet just here. Nice big circle all the way around. Good. So we're coming forward through the left, all the way to the right, to the back and centre. Good. Now I want you to see if you can contract each of your muscle groups as you're going around this lovely big hoop. Now take it back round the other way. Let's take it to the uh, left, to the right. Good. Forward and back. Lovely, let's go for two more, and one, brilliant, stop just here, I'm going to turn to the side so you can see me, take a big stride forward with your left leg, then bring your back heel off the floor, and then tilt your pelvis forward, so we're going to tilt, and then raise it back, 
So we're tilting it forward, then tilting it back. So we're going to go for four, three, two, one, and march. Brilliant, well done. Let's change it onto the other leg. So a big stride forward with that right leg. Bring the left heel off the floor, soft back knee, tilt it forward and back. Forward and back. Here we go. Four, three, two, one. And march. Well done. Super stuff. Brilliant. Now let's open up through the chest. You're going to stretch your arms forward and then slowly making your movement small and increasing the range of movement. My hands are coming up into my chest height. And I'm opening a big, that's what can we imagine when I open today, a big cupboard. So I'm opening my cupboard doors, see all my goodies when I finish my exercise. That's it squeezing between your shoulder blades as you're putting those arms back. Now I'm start to make your movements a bit bigger. That's going to open up your chest nice and safely, warming it up. Steady breathing. Now for me, just bring your chin into your chest. Bring it back a little bit. Good. Two. And one. Nearly there. Well done. Okay. Nice and easy. Knee tap and bend. Bend and tap. Bend and tap. Now I'm going to start to bring those arms and reach straight across the body. Elbow comes in. Lovely. Well done. If this is a bit too much with the arms, just keep with the legs. You're still warming up. Brilliant. Okay. We've got four, three, two, and one. Walk it here. Abduction. So starting our exercise with your right leg, soft supporting knee. You're going to straighten that leg and bring it right in front of you. Squeeze the inner thigh. Good. So you can squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. That's it. Keep it squeezing. Steady breath. You're working. Your inner thigh muscle here, keeping your hips level, holding onto the side there if you need to. Good. So keeping your foot flexed. That's it. Keeping the soft supporting knee onto the other side. So the soft supporting knee and then this leg stays straight. So my left leg is straight and I'm scooping my leaves, cleaning my path, scooping the leaves with the foot. That's it. Keeping that leg nice and straight, working the inner thigh. Keep with me. Steady more. We've got some hamstring curls coming up. Good, keep that going. Steady pace. Here we go. So, level three straight away. You're into this. Good, pulling down. Level two, you're just taking it nice and low with the arms at chest height. Level one, you're holding on to the side. Good, bringing the pace a little bit slower. So this is level one, this is level two, this is level three. Okay, so choose the level that suits you best. This is a good cardiovascular section. That's it. Double side step. So one and two together. One and two together. One and two. Level one. Level two. Here we go. Swimming arms. Good swimming arms. Level three. Swimming arms. And a clap. Swimming arms. And a clap. Good. That's it. Keep going. I'm going to take it down to level two. Good, nice straight arms coming out. Well done, we're into a punch. Grab your weights. Level one, just holding on, doing four punches with each hand and then swapping it round. Level two, alternating punch. Here we go. Level three, you're going to add in a little bit of a movement as well with the legs. Like we did in the warm up, bend and tap. That's it. Good, and then start to see if you can really turn your body a bit. Get your midriff working as well. Good, pop the weights down. Okay, arm circles. Take them forward, straight arms. This is a tricky one, this one. Heel pumping at the same time. So, we need to make sure that blood is coming back up to the level of the heart. So it's really important. Keep those heels pumping, turning those arms. That's the way. Keep it going. Nice steady breath. We've got a knee raise coming up. Can you keep those arms there? Well done. Level one, holding on to the side, alternating knee raise. Doesn't matter how far you come, 
do what you can manage. Level two, you're taking your hands in front of you and you're trying to get your knee to your hands. Level three, you're reaching down. Good, and you're bringing the pace up a little bit more. Well done, that's it. If this one feels a bit challenging, be true to yourself, just take it to here. Or take it to level one. Brilliant, well done, press up. Okay, so level one, pivot forward from the hips, hands onto your sideboard, elbows come out behind, and then straighten up. This time we're doing a narrow press, rather than sticking the elbows right out to the sides. Level two, nice straight body. Level three, up onto your toes. Good, so you need to choose the right level for you. That works you well. Okay, lunging back, level one. Holding on to the side, alternating toe tap behind. Level two, you're going to raise one arm and pop it down. Level three, you're gonna pick up your weights and you're going to go for an alternating raise. That's it. And lunging back, so you're actually doing double whammy. You're working your deltoids on the top of your arms, your shoulders, and you're doing a cardiovascular move as well. Okay, bent over row. So, level one, coming, pivoting forward from the hips. You're just gonna go for four elbows coming up, holding onto your weight, and then you're gonna swap it round and go for four repetitions onto the other side. Well done. Level two, you're going to hold this position, keeping your back flat, alternating. Level three, you're going to go for double whammy. Hold your core in. Good. Weights down. Back to the beginning. Okay, here we go. So this is a nice straight leg coming in front. Abduction, soft supporting knee. Good. Sweeping those leaps. Really think you've got some resistance there and you're really trying to come through all the way through those leaves are really heavy. That's it, soft knee, keep that leg straight, that's working. That's it, toe flexed. Hold on to the side if you need to, if you don't. Both hands onto your hips. Good, other leg, so, and again, straight leg comes in front, soft supporting knee. Scoop those leaves away, nice easy scoop. Steady breath, doing well guys, really well. Level three, hands onto your hips. Level two and one, just hold on to the side. Well done, you've got a hamstring curl coming up. Relax the shoulders down. You've got this guys, you can do it. Here we go, hamstring curl. So soft supporting knee, curling up behind. Good, level one. Level two, bringing the hands towards you. That's it, keep it shoulder, uh, chest height. Level three, we're going to go for a little bit higher. We're going to work it down. That's it. Let's go for a bit higher this time. That's it. Raising the hands above the head. Really get the heart rate going. We've got a double side tap coming up. Level one. Hold on to the side. One, together. Two, together. One, together. Two, together. Level two. Swimming arms. Good. Level three. Are you ready? Swimming arms, and then you're going to go for a, a little clap and a jump. Well, obviously, I wasn't ready. <laughs> Here we go. That's it. Nice and steady. Good. I'm going to do one more of these, and then I'm going to take it down to level two. Here we go. Right, so we are now into a punch. So level one, just going for four repetitions with one hand and then swapping it onto the other side. Level two, you're alternating. Good, level three, bend and tap, bend and tap. That's it, you got it. Adding a bit of cardio in as well. Arm circles coming up. That's it, I hope you guys are still with me. Right, <laughs> so let's take the arms up, I'm gonna circle forward. That's it, nice, he easy heel pump, so you're still getting that blood Travelling back up to the level of the heart. Now reverse it. Take it up and back. Good. Steady breath. If this is too tough for you, don't worry. Put your hands down and just pump the heels. Do what you can do. Just be true to yourself. It's really important that you respect your body and it will move along quicker with you. Knee raise. Level one. Just holding on to the side. 
alternating knee raise. Level two, place your hands up to about your belly height and see if you can touch your knee to your hand. Level three, arms above the head, give raise and let's pick that pace up a little bit more. Good stuff, you've got your press up, coming up next. You're nearly there guys, doing so well. Here we go, so level one, flat back, soft knees, pivot from the hips, elbows close towards the body, and up, good. So in for a press up, level two. You're going to straighten your legs, place your heels to where it feels comfortable for you, then might raise off the floor, that's fine. Level three, you've got to come up onto your toes, to keep that plank position. That's it. So your whole body is a plank. Bring it, lunge it back. Level one, alternating tap back, holding onto the side. Chin up there. Level two, raise one arm. Level three, grab your weights. Here we go. That's it. Increase your speed just by a little bit. So it's still controlled with the weights, but we're adding in cardio as well. Bent over row, coming up folks. So you're going to need your weights for this one. Steady breath. Here we go, level one. Flat back, pivot forward from the waist. Four repetitions, and then you're going to swap it round onto the other side. Level two, you're going to go for alternating. Level three, it's both together. So I'm squeezing my shoulder blades together, cracking a nut as I'm bringing those weights up. Good, keep that going. Steady breath. Nice flat back, tummy's pulled in, that's it, steady breathing, and pop your weights down, well done, yay, it didn't ding for me there, but we, yes, we have completed, we are now going to start the cool down, easy walk on the spot, now as you're walking on the spot, I'm just going to check that you guys are still with me, are we still with me, oh my goodness, we are, Fantastic, right, let's crack on. This is a miracle, it's working today. <laughs> okay, so nice easy walk from the spot. Lovely, wide stance, easy toe tap, good, soft knee and toe tap. Lovely, now as you're doing this, I'd like you to circle one all the way up and round, all the way up and round. Good, if this is a bit tricky of your shoulder joint, just take it forward, like you're polishing your table. Polishing, oh my goodness, that is something I need to do at home. <laughs> okay, so let's keep that going. Well done, see if I've got a full reach, really extend and reach. Get all the polish to the table. That's last one, and down, nice and easy. So we're just gonna to turn to our sideboard. We're gonna reach up and over and hold on to the side, good. Now I'm going to keep my heels pumping to bring my heart rate down slowly. This is a lovely upper back stretch. So my chin is towards my chest. And it's like doing a cat stretch if you're going to do that on the floor but you're high up. Now slowly bring your left arm up, raise it all the way up and round. And have a look to see how far you can look behind you. And this will depend on your flexibility. Do it so it feels comfortable, there should be no pain or discomfort, and then slowly bring that hand down. Now let's have a look with the other one, raise it all the way up, round, and see how far you can look. Can you look at your fingertips? Well done, and slowly bring it back down again, brilliant. Okay, let's try that one more time. Reach up, like we're diving in towards the sideboard, chin to the chest, open out through the spine, Good, lift up that left arm, reach all the way up. Good, have a look behind you, keeping that spine flexible and slowly bring the hand down to the side and then reach all the way up, have a look behind you and then back down to the side. Super stuff, three shot rolls, one, two and three. Great, now we're going to go for a heel dig, so it's one, two, three, and four. Now hold it here, soft supporting knee, hold on to the side there, push your bottom back, 
and start to feel that stretch down the hamstring. Now put that foot flat down onto the floor. If you feel comfortable, you can place your hands onto your thigh to increase that stretch and really elongate and lift, 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 up through the bottom, steady breath, and then slowly raise up, nice and easy. Well done, easy heel pump, good. Let's go back for our heel dates again. One, and two, three, and four. We're gonna swap it to the other side, heel in, good. Soft supporting knee, place your hands onto the sideboard for a little bit of support. Drop that foot down, push the bottom back, feel the stretch coming down through your right leg now. Hands onto the supporting knee if you wish. Good, steady breath, slowly bring the body up. Nice and easy, and an easy heel pump. Well done, folks. Now stop both the feet and see if you can bring up your left leg behind you, holding onto your trousers or onto the ankle. Soft supporting knee and just tilt the pelvis forward to increase that front of thigh stretch. Hold on to the side or stretch the arm out in front. If this is too tricky, pop the foot down, lift the heel and just tilt the pelvis. Good, feel the stretch into your hip flexor. So go with the stretch that works the best for you. Now I know we practiced this last time, let's see if we can do it again. We're going to see if we can hold on, start by holding on and then reach. You can glide your hand in front if you wish, lift the leg up or if you feel happy, raise the hand off. Good, and then bring the hands and the knee back to the midline of the body and put the foot down. Easy heel pump. Well done. I'm going to turn to face this way so you can see me a little bit better. So the right leg this time. Lift up that leg, holding onto your trousers and onto the ankle, soft supporting knee, good, and hold that stretch. Push your hip forward to increase it. Um, just like we said before, folks, pop your toe into the floor, lift the heel, tilt the pelvis for a hip flexor stretch if that one's too tricky. Good, be true to yourself and your body. Lovely, if you feel happy, you can raise your hands up there. Let's see if we can extend this stretch out. Now you can scoot that hand all the way forward on the surface so you've got a bit of support. Or if you want to raise the arm, please do so. Good, and then bring both knee and elbow into the midline of the body and put the foot down. Well done, guys. Upper chest stretch. You're going to reach all the way behind you, keeping your feet flat now onto the floor and push away. Good, so I'm opening my shoulder heads, squeeze between the shoulder blades, good, chin up there, steady breath. See it's looking beautiful today, nice and clear and very blue. Can't wait to go and have a look at it later. Okay, nice wide stance. Turn one toe out to 45 degrees on your left leg. Gently bring that knee towards the toe, hold on to the side. So you should feel an inner thigh stretch. If you haven't quite got that, take the leg a little bit further back and then a little bit of a bigger bend so you can feel that stretch. If the knee's going right over the toe, you do need to take that leg a little bit further forward. So we're gonna reach all the way up over the body. Keep a gap between your ear and your arm. Feel that stretch elongating all the way down the side. Slowly reach up and breathe, folks. So breath in and breathe out through purslet as you come over. Now this time, breathe in and then roll the body all the way down. Roll, 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 roll. And see if we can get to the other side. I'm going to turn your right toe out to 45 degrees. The other leg comes in and you're going to lift all the way up there. Good. Now get your posture again, so we're gonna roll that hand down. So make sure you're bending your right knee towards the toe, you're feeling an inner thigh stretch. If you haven't quite got it, take a bigger stance and bend that knee a little bit more. If it's too much, bring it in a little bit. Breath in through the nose, breath out through pursed lips. Good, gap between ear, out the elbow, breath in, and breath out, 
taking it all the way to the center. Lovely. And then slowly work your feet in. Brilliant. Nearly there, folks. Doing really well. Slowly roll the shoulders up and back. Nice big shoulder roll up and back. Now bring your chin to your chest and increase that stretch a little bit more down the back. Now hold on to the side here. If you feel happy with me, just come into a, a slow fold, coming down vertebrae by vertebrae to about hip height. We're not gonna go all the way down. If you feel happy to do that, that's fine. Then slowly roll all the way back up, vertebrae by vertebrae, stacking on the top leg, good. Now get your bearings, easy hill pump, lovely. And then we're gonna go for some nice breathing. So we're gonna take a deep breath in through the nose, breathing out through pursed lips. This time when we breathe in, we're taking our right arm out to the side, and then we're breathing out. Then we're gonna take a breath in, taking the left arm out, and then breathing out, and then both breath in, and then breathing out. So ready to follow me, off we go. Breath in, and exhale. Breath in, and exhale. Breath in, and exhale. And again, breath in, and exhale. Breath in, and exhale. Breath in, and exhale. Nice and controlled. Activity completed. And roll up. Yes! Well done everybody! We have made it through a full 30 minutes today. Give yourself a round of applause. That was awesome work. And I hope I'm still with you. So I'm just going to check again. Are we still with you? Yes! Yes we are! Brilliant! Thank you all for your patience. You have been wonderful. And I would just like to say for next week we have got a great little challenge. We have got a seven day TheraBand workout challenge. So I hope you will join me for that one. That's really good. If you did like today, do hit the like button and the subscribe and maybe share with your friends. And before we go, I'm just going to do some shout outs. So today we have got on the chat, exercising with us, we've got Alan Ray. Hello, good morning, Alan Ray. And we have got Heather from Vienna. Good morning, Heather. And we have got Dorothy and Margaret zooming in together. Good morning, guys. Great to have you here with me today. And then we've got Denise. Good morning, Denise. Hello. And we've got Eileen. Good morning. And we've got Jackie. Good morning. And we've got Barbara. Good morning. And we've got uh, Pauline in Belfast. Good morning. Love the balloons, Pauline. And um, that's great. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I shall see you all for next time. So have a great day. Keep safe. Keep well. And um, bye for now. Bye. Ciao, ciao.